I'm warning you Peter Kioi. I'll be the reason me Prince Mwiti. It is funny to this kadamas. It is very funny to this kadamas. It is not funny to me. You are taking this too far. Unachukulia kitu too far with me. You are taking it too far with me Peter Kioi. Kama uko na evidence yoyote na haribu vijana wadogo, go to the DCI. Na kama uko na evidence yoyote niliua chira, please go to the DCI. Go to the DCI. That is their work. Please go. Go even now. Umeanza kuwa mjinga. It is getting very very personal. It is getting very personal Peter Kioi. And I'm warning you for the last time. You, uh, excuse me, you're my good friend. And he's getting very personal, Peter Kioi. Chekesha makadama. Wachekeshe. Aya. And I'm like, one, please, just leave me alone, bro. Unless, kama kuna evidence, niliuwa achira. Unless, kama kuna evidence, na haribu vijana wadogo. Na unless, ukona evidence, nikono ukimwi, please. Talk. It is getting too personal, me and you. Peter Kioi, si jito uliza mina we nini. I don't know. Na nataka kujua nani huyo mwenye anakupea kiburi unajipiga kifua. I know you on a personal level. Nataka kujua ni nani huyo anakupea kiburi kunishinda. Twende nalo. Mwenye anakupea kiburi kunishinda, haya twende nalo. Ni... Na muache kutupigia kelele kama muiti aliua chira, mpelekeni kotini bus. Taka taka hizi. If you have evidence, stop shouting about it here on the platform. Go. Enda mkaenda unafikiria tujui kitu mnajaribu hapa we know very well that wewe na Peter Kioi mnajua vizuri you need money to go to Kenya so you are starting this violence against Mwiti na kufufua story ya chira kwa sababu unataka mchango unafikiria tujui who doesn't know what you doing we danganya watu wajinga wenye wakujui we know what you're planning on doing we know you don't have the money you're broke you want to go home with money so you are starting a narrative about Chira because you know that is what makes people very emotive on this platform. Alafu unaanza narrative. Kwa sababu you want to gain some coins here. Upatiwe mchango. Ati we pia unaongelelea coins za watu. Ala. Na wewe umeshinda hapa mpaka hata utoi suruali ukingoja coins. Una beg mpaka manigan. Kwa birthday yako ulikuwa na beg mpaka manigan. And you here talking about people getting coins. How does it bother you? Mtu akiwa na level, nani amekukataza kubadilisha level? Nani amekukataza level inapandishwa na pesa bwana? Si wapi upandisha level? Nani amekukataza pandisha level? Kwani kuna 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 bunduki watu wanawekewa ndio upandisha level? Nani amekukataza pandisha level hata wewe uko hiyo level 40 bwana? Why does it bother you watu wakiwa na level 40? It's because you wish you were in that level and you you can't achieve it. Wezi, we ni mwanamke mwenye unaomba mpaka bundles na umetoka UK, unaomba utumiwe bundles na wa Kenya kwa live. For you to go live, unaomba bundles kwa wafuasi wako wa kutumia bundles. Ati wende unakuja kuni address, chekesha. Nani anatokanga from a first world country kukuja kuomba watu wenye wako Kenya a third world country bundles? If it's not you, and you talk about class, I forget the matter to Nakuja. Mungu Baba to Nakuja Meliako. Mungu Baba to Neka Kapunye, Maisha Kapunye Guaniniako. Mungu Baba, Unajua Akona Kilipungwan. Kapunye Diana Rose, Akona Kilipungwan. She thinks that she is very opinionated and she is disputing to Kenya. Mungu Baba, to Nele. Very long. Mungu baba, mimi na respect bwanake alifanyaga dunia lakini Mungu baba wewe ndio unapeana mabwana na unachukua mabwana muongeze mwingine awache kukua loni Mungu baba kapunye ameharibika kichwa mpaka anatukana familia yake na brada yake anaitisha brada yake 3.2 million na brada yake alikuwa anafuata nyako nyuma Aki... normal dana roga na akili normal Mungu baba Mungu baba atawe ni akili na jioni tuwa mtoto wako ukamleta kwa hii dunia atukufie dhambi zetu 
lakini niambie mtu mgali anashikisha ndugu yake anamweka kwa police custody alafu kaze keni kutukana na kuingilia maneno za wadu level and send ya Mungu baba niambie kama wewe usiyakifungua ni Mungu Mungu baba pia kapunye amani pia kapunye bwana Mungu baba hata kinapoingia mboka ni lete rich people Mungu baba na kila mtu uko na wadui na muiti Mshutie. 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 Kila mtu kwa WhatsApp na muiti. Na wanaongelea muiti huko Mungu Baba. And I don't even punish them. Mshutie wasikia rufu mbaya yako Mungu. Ndio wake kuchezea tena Mungu Baba. Wakini chezea tena watajua mimi ni mwana wako. Mungu Baba. Mungu Baba mnapokuja mbele yako, nilete watu matajiri, niondolee hawa wamekujia umbea wako mbele yangu pale hivi yangu. Niondolee, nilete watu matajiri peke yake. Hawa waumbea waende kwa Anabenta, wanatukana wakitukana na na Trisakali, Anabenta ameambia Trisakali awachane na mambo yake na bilibusioka. Na hii Trisakali na Kerere, sijui ilikuwa ina muhusu waje. Sasa wameanza vita. Mungu Baba, hata tunapokuja Lucy Kibaki, aka Roch, na Tumri Comedian, wako karibu kuwana Mungu Baba. Mungu Baba tupea amani. Tupea amani. Geoffrey Comedian, karibu tuoneshe sura ya nyanya yake na pali anatoka na ndugu zake wote. Na huyo Roch Comedian, na huyo Lucy Kibaki, aka Roch. Mungu Baba wapea amani tunataka amani kila mtu akikaa hivi tukikaa hivi vita vita ina kila era from from noya mungu baba na huyu mwingine anakaa waru imepakwa makeup jb kiparangoto mungu baba hiyo waru imepakwa makeup nitole kwa maisha yangu amenipaja na niuma na niuma na niuma na niuma hata kikaa kupeleka so simtesi jamani mungu baba wapelekane jamani katika jina la yesu tunaomba na kuamini